I'm standing here in central London on the Millennium Bridge, which is a, a bridge from South London to, to North London with St Paul's Cathedral behind me. And as we're in the middle of this Advent series, thinking about what it means that Jesus was born into our world, this bridge for me signifies or, or just reminds me of Jesus' need with the Holy Family to leave Bethlehem after Herod had started the search for the Holy Child and was killing the innocents and the Holy Family had to go to Egypt. And it's really significant when you think about the history of the Old Testament and you realise that God's people were enslaved in Egypt and there's this amazing motif of Exodus of God delivering his people out of Egypt, delivering them through the Exodus, that Jesus is the fulfillment of that. That even in his birth, even in the story of the arrival of God in history, we see that Exodus motif. At the end of God's people sort of leaving Egypt and going towards the Promised Land, we have that image of the Passover where the lamb is, is slaughtered and the blood is put on the lintels of each door. And for every family that did that, the angel of death would pass over that family and that family would be delivered because of the blood on the lintel. And so we're reminded that Jesus is the Passover lamb. He is the one who sheds his blood for our deliverance. So the Holy Family going to Egypt and then being brought out of Egypt and Matthew quotes from the Old Testament where it says, out of Egypt I've brought my son. That motif of the family being refugees is a reminder to us that Jesus has come to deliver, that he is gonna be our Passover lamb, that it's through him that we escape the angel of death. It's through him that we can be forgiven and redeemed. So as you consider the meaning of Advent for you, as you prepare your heart for Christmas, think about what it means that Jesus and the Holy Family went down into Egypt and that he is the one who is our exodus, our deliverance from slavery and our Passover lamb.